I never miss a chance to point out when the young Turks are lying, when the leftist, socialist, young Turks are manipulating the truth and lying. I never miss a chance to point it out, and that's what we're going to do today. We're going to point out their last video where this man was lying about the Americans uh, who are unemployed, the Americans without a job. He was making a lie about Maria Bartiromo, and today we're going to expose their lie. But listen first to the comment Maria Bartiromo made. Yeah. Almost 40% of Americans are without a job and are not looking. Many have given up. That's what the participation rate tells us. So, you heard the statement that Maria Bartiromo made. That's the statement that this man is... They're basically, the Young Turks are claiming that Maria Bartiromo is lying, that Fox News is lying, that the Young Turks are on the attack. But unfortunately, the Young Turks are wrong, and I'm going to prove it today. We're going to prove it with numbers. See, this man likes to talk a lot, but he has no numbers to back it up. Now, if you go back and listen to that clip, or I'm going to give that clip to you again a little later, you can hear, you'll listen, that Maria Bartiromo never mentioned the word unemployed or unemployment at all. All she mentioned was people who did not have a job and people who gave up on even looking. Okay, Big difference between the unemployed, the people on unemployment checks, because the government manipulates that number. They say, oh, only 6 or 7% of the country are getting an unemployment check. Well, that may be correct, but there's millions and millions of more people who don't have a job, who have stopped looking, and they don't get an unemployment check. And that's the number one thing this idiot has missed. Or I don't believe, you know what, I really don't believe this guy is dumb. I don't believe he's dumb or stupid. I believe that he's bought and paid for by some Wall Street hedge fund. And I believe that they tell him what to say and he has to say it by the word. And I believe if he wants a paycheck, he has to do exactly what his Wall Street bosses tell him to do. So I really don't think he's dumb or stupid. Or I hope he's not. Now let's hear Maria say it one more time. Yeah. Almost 40% of Americans are without a job and are not looking. Many have given up. That's what the participation rate tells us. So there, you heard Maria say it again. All she mentioned was the people who do, do not have a job and are not looking. She never used the unemployment word at all. This guy manipulated and twisted around the story. Now, and also, he goes on and yammers and yammers and rants and raves about how Maria is lying. But he's the one lying. He doesn't even understand that there are 94 million people not even in the labor force. Now, remember... For Maria's number to be close, she said almost 40% of Americans. That would that number would be somewhere around 120 million. So her number, if you if you narrowed her number down, 120 million would be very close to almost 40% of the population. Now, if you got 94 million people who are out of the labor force, we're very very close right there. And then you add the 10% of the people who are on disability. And I'm going to go. We're going to go into a chart here. Look at my numbers on my homemade chart. And I'm going to tell you that Maria is right and that the Young Turks are lying. Watch the chart. Look at the chart. Okay, so I'm going to try to prove to you through this homemade chart. You can do the number. You can check on the numbers yourself. I made another video uh, explaining this homemade chart, but we'll go on. We'll go over this. Now, the number up at the top, you're going to be wondering what the bloodsuckers are. 40 million government workers. Okay, so bloodsuckers represent 40 million government workers. That means they don't make anything or build anything. They just they just suck taxpayer money. So the taxpayers pay for 40 million workers. Then we'll go on there. You see the 62 million uh, Burger King workers. But the most important part of this chart is you see that the 94 million people who are not in the labor force. That's the most important part right there. The 94 million Americans who are not in the labor force. You've got to realize most of these do not, I repeat, they do not get an unemployment check. And that's why Maria Bartiromo did not mention the word unemployment in her statement. Her statement was correct. It, and, and that's what the young Turks being young and naive and uh, halfway stupid, they didn't realize she never used the word unemployed, unemployed or unemployment. Because these 94 million people here, most of them do not get an unemployment check. Now, that's clear. Now, if we go down uh, a little farther, 
a little later in this chart, I'm going to show you that there are 50 million people uh, on disability and um, Social Security. Now, if you go to the Social Security site, they'll even tell you that there's like 9 million people on disability, not working, not working. Most of those people are just faking it. They, they, they know that there's, not, there's no job for them. That's the, that's the dirty little secret in America, that the, 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 most of the 9 million people on disability are there because they cannot find a job, so they just fake that they have a back hurt. You see right here? Uh, I'm talking about the 9 million people on disability. I'm almost positive the majority of them uh, are, are faking it, are getting disability because they cannot find a job. And, you know, do you have to do what you have to do. Now, if you also... If you add in, all if you go up there to the 62 million, up above there, you I told you up above right there you see 62 million Burger King workers. Now, there if you add in all the waitresses and Burger King workers who are only working one or two days a week, that's not a job. Trust me, and that's what Maria Bartiromo is trying to say. The people who are working one or two days at McDonald's, that's not a job, and you have to include them, and you easily get to 120 million people, easily. The Young Turks are lying again. Yes, and that's why I have to speak out. You see, there's actually, these, these Young Turks have, actually have 2 million people listening to their bullshit half the time. Now, no, don't get me wrong. Sometimes, not all the time, sometimes they're right on base. I just point out when they're lying, and this is one of the times. They lie about guns. They lie about uh, a lot of things. Now, they're lying about unemployment here, or they're lying about Maria Bartiromo. It's basically this whole lie is they're, they're throwing their lie on a, a nice lady like Maria Bartiromo. And Maria's numbers were very, very close. I proved that. And uh, you may not like my homemade chart, but if you go do the checking on your own, you check, you back, you check my numbers on my homemade chart, they're all right. They're, those numbers are out there on the Internet for you to find. This man here, he offered no numbers. He offered nothing for you to go look for. My numbers are right there. 94 million people not in the labor force. 9 million people on disability. A bunch of one- and two-day Burger King workers. My numbers are there for you to verify. He's lying, and I just proved it.